Good morning, everybody. Ken Gonzalez here for George Lange Event Productions. We are here at the 2010 edition of the Las Vegas Mayor's Cup. A beautiful morning here, and we've got a girls under 17 match. The synergy on the left half of your squad traveling from Chicago, Illinois, that area there. I think they're actually from old suburb, and they are battling the Sparta United 93. Sparta United in the I guess you could say the lighter blue. And of course, Synergy in the Navy with the green numbers. Two 30 minute halves here. No overtime. This is the very first game of the 2010 Las Vegas Mayor's Cup. And it's a Synergy moving to the far corner. Number 31, Ashley Altman stops. Now she makes her move inside. And the ball rolls into the hands of the Sparty United keeper, Lexi Smith. We'll get to the rosters for each of these teams here in just a few minutes. Ball in the middle third of the field. Synergy's number seven trying to dribble away out of there. Kristen Warner and taken away by Sparta United. They control it right here in the circle. We're coming at you from Kellogg Zayer, field number four. This along with the Betty Wilson soccer complex, the two busiest of the soccer complexes used here in this tournament. They do have a couple of other venues that they've added here, which they normally do not see. Ball far side, number nine for Sparta United, Kendra Nelson. She runs into trouble. She's got to dribble her way out. And now back up, up, back up top is Sparta United. Left-legged kick into the middle towards the back line. There's the center, and it's going to be wide of the net and out across the back line. And so... The goal kick coming up here for Synergy and the keeper, Michelle Vanakin. So Vanakin will retrieve the ball and the goal kick coming from the far side. Just a beautiful morning here. 8.40 a.m. start, but the way the weather is, I mean, this could be two in the afternoon. Calm winds, a little bit warm, clear skies. Synergy breaking away on the far side. Now they got to move in, though, as the defense gets back for Sparta United in the box. Pushed out, and number two is going to come away with it, Amberin McAlson. Amberin far side fires it down the sideline, up across midfield. And now it's going to be a foot race. Over on that far side, number 14 for Sparta United. Sarah Scanchi runs into trouble. Defense gets back for Synergy. Number 26, Mia Patrevito. And taken away. Nice job there. Mia Patrevito trying to bring it up towards midfield. Runs into some trouble. Gets some help from her teammates. I haven't forgotten. We'll get to the rosters. Again, remember... 30-minute halves, no overtime in these bracket play games. Today, Saturday, the 13th of February, 2010. I believe tomorrow, Valentine's Day. Synergy here on the near side, number 27. Can she get an angle? She gets to the ball. That's Bree Borsellino. And let's see, Bree's going to run out of room there on this near side. And the ball goes out across the back line. Goal kick here for Sparta United. The keeper, Lexi Smith. She'll take the kick. Kick here taken by number 27, Bree Borsellino. She's going to be tripped up there looking for a whistle, but nothing. And in fact, I don't even think we've had a whistle so far here in this match. Synergy keeping the action here on the defensive third of Sparta United. Number 25 in the middle. That's Callie Willett. Callie over to the far side. Looking for number 16, Noel Ekanamu.
And number two will take the kick there for us at Amberin McCalson. So we'll give you the rosters here for Synergy. Number 27 is Bree Borsellino. Number 16 is Noel Ekenamu. Number 15, Erica Falarski. Number 11, Liz Frazier. Number 18, Kerry Hanley. The defense makes a stand right there for Synergy. Ashley Altman, number 31. Number 26, Mia Patrivito. Number 3, Britt Pullen. Number 1, Haverly Snyder. Number 4 is Ali Stellatello in front of the net. And just wide. Nice save there by the keeper. Michelle Vanaken. Number 14 is Jen Vanderpool, the keeper, Michelle Vanaken. Number 7, Kristen Warner. Number 25, Callie Willett. Number 6, Rachel Weber. And number 29 is Bridget Whitman. Jim Willett is the head coach, and the assistant coach is Ella Massar. No score here, first half. A whistle coming from the field behind us, field number five. Up the middle of the field, right into the hands of Lexi Smith. And that whistle just reminds us we still haven't had one here in our match. Ball in the left half of the field. Sparta United trying to spread things. Number 13 with a leg on the ball. Rebecca Solomon fired away up towards midfield by Synergy. And now with the header, number seven moves it across midfield. Kristen Warner in the circle. Help there by number 18, Carrie Hanley. And taken away by Sparta United far side. This is the cross into the middle. A lot of traffic though, and Sparta United not able to do anything there as it's cleared out. Number seven, Christian Warner. Number 13, Rebecca Solomon for Sparta United was trying to recover that ball, but was out of position, couldn't do so. Ball live here. It's going to roll out near a side. Let's see which way the flag goes, and it will give possession to Sparta United. It's a girls under 17 match. Sparta United and Synergy. High into the air, number one with that header, Haverly Snyder for Synergy. Right half, now across. Snyder again gets a leg on it. Looking for some help, number 13, Solomon across. Number seven hits the ground, Kristen Warner. So a lot of action back and forth, but let's see if one of these teams can take control and have a nice possession here. And right now the opportunity is going to go to Synergy as they'll have the ball here on the near side. Right at midfield. Substitution. Looks like number three is coming out. Britt Brit Pullen. And number four. Ali Stellatello is in. Number 25 also out. Callie Willett. All right, so they got a new ball here. They'll put it into play on the near side. Number 17 for Sparta United. Caitlin Jasenbach. Saved here on the near side from going out by number 10, Natalie Williams. Williams with it again. Now she looks into the middle of the field. There's her cross. Cleared out. Number 11 coming up top to help out. That's Liz Frazier. Frazier now trying to get back to it. Sarah Scanchi, though, number 14, releases it just in the nick of time. Synergy's defense there, three deep. Clear it up towards midfield. Really, no legitimate shots on goal for either side. Very tough game in the pitch right now. 
Nobody really getting an opening. And now let's see what Synergy can do. Dribbling downfield. Too many of the lighter blue, the royal blue jerseys in the middle. Now far side. 21 fires it. Matty Adams. Now where is number nine? Kendra Nelson going with that one. She had no openings. Made something. Shot on goal. It's going to be wide of the net. So Sparta United gets one off there. And last touch by that kicker, Sparta United. So ball goes to Synergy. Number 29 in now for Synergy, Bridget Whitman. Looks like she's going to replace number 16. Noel Economo. All right, so the action resumes. Let's see if Sparta United can keep the pressure here in Synergy territory. And there's your first whistle of the match. That's going to go against number four, Ali Stellatello for Synergy. And the free kick right there for Sparta United. Number three, Ashlyn Braun. Ashlyn's kick angled over to the far side, pushing it towards the net. And that ball's going to skip right into the back of the net past the diving keeper. And Sparta United on top here as they take a 1-0 lead. And I believe that was, it's all started there by Ashlyn Braun. On the kick. And so Sparta United with a 1-0 lead quickly. Synergy gets the ball into play again. Let's see if they can come back. We're only in the first half here. Twelve minutes in, the ball rolls out here. Synergy ball. So 18 minutes to go here in the first half towards the back line. And on that header, it goes out across the back line, off Synergy. And so the goal kick here for Sparta United. They have the 1-0 lead. The right leg, kick into the circle. Now back out here on the right half. Let's see if Synergy can push the issue here. They trail by a goal towards the back line and picked up by the keeper. And so another goal kick for Sparta United. A little bit. Let's see if Synergy can keep the pressure here on the right half of the field. Nice header there, number four, Ali Stellatello. Ball in the middle of the field. These first games, you know, of the tournament, both these teams traveling to get here. And then you've got an early 8.40 a.m. start on the first day towards the back line. Number 15 running it down, Erica Filarski. Filarski inside, try to get out over to number 23. Down the middle, cleared away. Actually, that was in 23, and that last play was number 27, I should say. Bree Borsellino, and Bree there with the kick. Far side of the field, number six. Rachel Weber and number 29, Bridget Whitman over there far side. Sparta United again on the attack. There's the cross. They can't get a shot. Nice job of the defense clearing that one away. Getting past the defense, number 15 had an opening there. 
Erica Falarski. There was kind of a unexpected opening there, and she was just too far behind the ball to catch up to it and make something happen there as the keeper had come up to meet her. Keeper being Lexi Smith for Sparta United, but right here on the near side, Synergy with a nice opportunity as they'll put the ball into play. Number 11, Liz Frazier. Overhand and number 27. Bree Borsellino into the middle, taken by Synergy. Nice job there, number 18, of getting to the ball. Carrie Hanley. Defense for Sparta United clears it up towards midfield. But as I was saying, you know, these early games may take some teams, you know, a little 20 minutes or so to get the, uh, the blood flowing and get into the tournament mode. Very close one here, 1-0 one in favor of Sparta United, first half, about 15 minutes to go. A little push to the back right there, towards the back line, that's gonna be off, Sparta United, and so we're gonna have a corner kick here for Synergy, for the, so the first real break here in the first half for Synergy. And let's see who's gonna take the kick, number seven, Kristen Warner setting up you also have number 11 down there, Liz Frazier. And it's Frazier, just gets the ball going right to Warner. There's a cross, oh, they wanted that shot. They got it, but just too high over the crossbar. So nice job there by Synergy, setting up that play. And now substitutions, number 31 and number three are in number three, Britt Pullen, number 31. Ashley Altman. For number 18, Carrie Hanley. And number seven, Kristen Warner. Synergy after the substitutions, keeping the pressure here on the right half. Out. Let's see on that corner. Did it go out across the back line or on the side here? Let's see if it's a corner kick. Number 11, Liz Frazier running it down. So it is a corner, and Frazier will take it. Let's see where she goes with it if they attack. Towards the middle, number 31 was hanging around out there, Ashley Altman, but the header by Sparta United cleared it away, and now Sparta to midfield in the circle. Number 14 dribbles it across, Sarah Scanchi. Scanchi's pass is gonna be deflected, getting there, number six. Rachel Weber. Ball fired out across the far side there. And Synergy will have it. Coming upon the 20th minute of play. Synergy's defense gets back. Nice job clearing it out across that far side. Number 14, Jen Vanderpool. Flag goes up far side, ball belongs to Synergy. All right, throw comes in. As we said, just about 10 minutes, maybe a little bit less now, remaining in the first half, one nil. Sparta United, number 17 in the circle. She can't quite get a leg on it, Caitlin Jasenbach. Ball here to the near line, and out and off of Sparta United. Number 31 retrieves it, Ashley Oltman, number 15. Erica Falarski will put the ball into play here near side. Throws it, angles it into the corner. 
and she gets right back to it. Filarski now fired up to midfield by Sparta United. Well, if the score remains this way into halftime, you know, you got to be halfway pleased if you're Synergy. Obviously, you've got eight or nine minutes to try to get the tying score. What you don't want, obviously, is to give up that second goal of the half. And substitutions far side, number 17, coming out, Caitlin Jazumbach. And she's replaced by number 16, Sarah Silverstein. Synergy takes a shot towards the net. It's going to be just wide. Liz Frazier, the strong leg. She saw an opening, decided to take the shot from about maybe 40 yards, 35. It was just wide of the net. Into the match now, number seven and number 25. Number seven, Kristen Warner, number 25. Callie Willett. And sitting out, number four, Ali Stellatello, and number 27, Brie Borsellino. Ball at midfield and across. It's going to be a foot race. Defense gets there for Synergy. Can they save it? No. And Sparta United will put it into play here on the near side. Number 26 fires it upfield into the middle. Mia Patrovito. And the ball out far side. So we'll give you the roster now for Sparta United. Number two is Amberin McCallison. Number three, Ashlyn Braun. Number four, Whitney King. Number five, Megan Westman. Number seven is Stephanie Dudley. Number eight, Emma Jackson. Number nine, Kendra Nelson. Number 10, Natalie Williams. Number 11, Maddie Williamson. Number 13, Rebecca Solomon. Number 14, Sarah Scanchi. Number 17 is Caitlin Jazumbach. Number 16, Sarah Silverstein. The keeper, number 20, Lexi Smith. Ball out far side. Number 21 is Maddie Adams. Number 23, Gabrielle Mattencaw. And number 25 is Stacy Bell. So there's the roster for Sparta United. Sparta spreading the field on the far side. Now they come inside. Cleared away by the Synergy defense. And a whistle there, that's going to go against number three, Britt Brit Pullen. And quickly, Sparta gets it back into play. Number 14 in a foot race with the keeper gets past and just wide of the net. Huge break right there for Synergy. Number 14, you see as she's on the ground, Sarah Scanchi, her hand to her forehead, thinking she might have just blown a huge opportunity to put Sparta up 2-0. So a break there for Synergy. They will have the goal kick. And a chance to clear it away from their net. Down the middle. Now in the left half. Synergy across midfield on the run now. Number 15, can she get there? She does, Erica Filarski. At number two, Amberin McCallison for Sparta United there defensively takes it away. Now clears it up across midfield. Synergy has it at midfield. Now they want to move it here to the near side. And out, Sparta ball. Ball far side towards the back line. And I was going to say a little push there, and the referee did see it. Number four, Whitney King guilty. 
and gives the ball over to Synergy. Across midfield, Synergy now is going to try to put some pressure on. Obviously, it, see if they can't tie this match before halftime. Number 18 now in for Synergy. That's Kerry Hanley. And let's see who's coming out. Number 15, Erica Falarski. Ball is out far side. Put into play quickly by Sparta United. And out again this time over to Synergy. Synergy's number seven. Kristen Warner towards the back line. Warner with the left leg. Tries that center shot there. And it goes out. And let's see, last touched by Sparta United. So the corner kick on the far side for Synergy. So a late break here, number 11. Liz Frazier will take the kick. Here it comes. Bounces once. Now cleared up top. 26th minute of play, so under five minutes to go here in the first half. Number 10 to midfield and across midfield with the pass. Taken nicely by Synergy there, number 26. Mia Patrovito. Number three sends it right back to the keeper there. Britt Pullen. Lexi Smith tried to clear it here to the near side, but it went right to Britt, and she fired it right back at her, and some quick hands by Lexi. May have saved a score there. Ball at midfield, now here on the left half. Sparta United's number two, trying to dribble her way out of some trouble there. Amblin, Amber and McAlson. Flag goes up, ball belongs to Synergy. Ball here on the right half into Sparta United territory. Defenso trying to clear it up to midfield. Can't do. Synergy keeping it here on the right half. Liz Frazier, number 11. And a whistle, and that's going to go against Sparta United. So the free kick there for Frazier. And let's see where she goes with it. Let's see if they attack straight away here. Under two minutes to go here in the first half. There's the kick down the middle, header back towards the keeper. And that would have been a score put in by the defense if that would have found its way into the net. But there was Lexi Smith, the keeper. Number seven. In the middle there for Sparty United. Now hit to the near side. Number 16, Sarah Silverstein. She's going to lose it to her counterpart. Number 16, Noel Ekanamu. Sparty United in the middle third. Nice slide save right there off to her teammate. Allows Synergy to clear it up to midfield. 29th minute of play.
field in front of us there across the screen far side. They have already hit halftime, so the whistle is imminent. Ball down the middle, cleared back up towards midfield. Let's see if Synergy can get one last shot here before the end of the half. Looking upfield, Synergy. Nice pass, number 31, squeaks by the defense. Now she looks into the middle. And her cross is going to be deflected there. Number 31, Ashley Altman. And there's the whistle in the end of the first half. So just about 12 minutes into this half, Sparta United puts a score on the board, and that's where we are at halftime. 1-0 over Synergy. King is also here for Georgia Langevin Productions. We're at the 2010 Las Vegas Mayor's Cup. We'll be back with the second half in just a few minutes. And welcome back to Kellogg Zaire Field, number four, girls under 17 match. They've switched sides. Sparta United defending the left net now. Synergy on the right half, and it's a 1-0 lead for Sparta United as we start the second half. Ball over to the far side of the field. And out. Sparty United ball, they have the one nil lead, second half, final 30 minutes of play. What a game to start things off here, the 2010 Las Vegas Mayor's Cup. It's really truly becoming an international event. We've got Canadian teams later on tonight. We have the girls under 19, Canada and Denmark. Teams from Germany, I believe France. Ball across midfield. Remember Sparta United in the royal blue, moving from left to right, Synergy in the Navy. Beautiful weekend, starting out anyway here in Las Vegas. I was actually here last weekend and it was cold and rainy the entire time, so what a difference a week makes. You can see the mountains behind us or actually in front of us there. And they've still got some white cap. So there was plenty of snow to be had here in the mountain ranges. It was very cold in the 40s. Beautiful day here. I think the high is going to be around 65. Nice President's Day weekend. Ball across midfield. Both number 14s battling it out there. Allison Ali Stellatello and number 14, Sarah Scanchi. Ball out far side. Looks like number 16 for Sparta United. Sarah Silverstein will put the ball into play. Bit of confusion, another game there had the ball go out in the same spot. So that ball rolls out far side, goal kick here for the Synergy who trail one nil. Let's see who's going to come away with that one. Liz Frazier, number 11, battling for it. She fires it across midfield. Number 31 over to help out. Ashley Oltman. Ashley manages to keep it in front of her and passes it upfield. Now moving into the middle, Synergy. 
Still controlling the ball. Let's see the nice little short passing game. Now they go into the middle. And it'll roll into the hands of the keeper, Lexi Smith. Ball rolls through the circle. Sparta United on the run, but the defense is there for Synergy. Nice job on that header there, number 14 direction on that ball. Jen Vanderpool. And a push by number 27. The whistle comes in just a little bit late. Bree Borsellino guilty there. Ball out near side. But we'll have the free kick, of course, because of the whistle. For Spartet United, number two, Amberin McCalson. Ball far side of the field, number 16. Saves it from going out, Sarah Silverstein. Now picked up, scooped up by the keeper there, Lexi Smith. Ball near side. Now into the middle of the field, number 15, across midfield. That pass to Synergy's number 29, Bridget Whitman. Whitman runs it down, controls it, dribbles it up to midfield, now across. Pass into the middle of number four, Ali Stellatello. And cleared back the other way by Sparta United. Sparta United looking for somewhere to go with it. Taken away by Synergy across midfield. And let's see if the team with the Navy uniform, Synergy, can make something happen here. Try to put something together offensively. And the ball is out far side, and let's see, they'll switch it and get possession to Sparta United. Plenty of time for Synergy. There's a shot up the middle there, and right into the hands of the keeper, Michelle Von Acken. Synergy battling here on the near side. They've got to start putting some pressure on that defense of Sparta United, wearing them down. Keep knocking on the door. Make something happen. If you wear them down, you're going to get an opening. You're only down by a goal. Synergy near side ball is out. Off Sparta United. Left to right, towards the middle, nice takeaway there, coming across the middle, number 15 for Synergy. Erica Filarski. And they get right about to the defensive third of Sparta United, and it's sent back the other way. And now we're gonna have a foot race. Number 14 gets past the defenders. Von Aken setting up, that's gonna get right past her, but the kick is wide of the net. So a misfire there by Sparta United, number 14. Sarah Scanchi, but you know, coming out, the keeper making a play on that one. Michelle Von Aken did just enough to change the direction of that shot and give her team the goal kick. So a break there. You know, they had one towards the end of the first half, too. Sparty United had driven down, and that shot on goal was just wide of the net. So. It is still only 1-0, and these are the types of games, if you're Sparta United, where you've, I'm not going to say blown some opportunities, but you had a couple of opportunities and just couldn't convert either. 
you know, because of the defense or otherwise. You get down late into a game, you still only have a one nil lead, anything happens, you give up that tie, and then you go kick yourself in the locker room afterwards. There's a shot towards the net, nice save right there. Michelle Van Aken pushes it out. It'll give a corner kick to Sparta United, but it will also allow the Synergy defense to set up and make it difficult for that Sparta United squad. So let's see what happens. First corner kick of the day for Sparta United. I think we've had three for Synergy. And it's number three for Sparta United, Ashlyn Braun to take the kick. High into the air, it's going to hit the side of the net. So a break right there. So a nice exchange for Synergy as they get the best of that one. They'll have the ball. Let's see you know, if they can build some momentum. Number three and number one into the match now for Synergy. Number one, Haverly Snyder. Number three, Britt Pullen for number four, Allison Ali Stellatello. So some fresh legs in for Synergy. Number 31 is also out. Ashley Altman. Liz Frazier there in the middle, number 11. Now running it down far side, number 29. Bridget Whitman. She just can't get there. It goes out, but I, believe, I do believe it was last touched by Sparta United. So Synergy will have the throw in there far side. Ball bounces a couple times towards the net and right of the hands of Michelle Von Aken, the keeper for Synergy with the save. Now let's see if they can take some momentum. Firing quickly across midfield, number 18. Carrie Hanley still moving towards the back line, deep into Sparta United territory. Ball is going to be cleared into the near side, but not nearly far enough. Carrie Hanley again makes sure it goes into the middle of the field. And now Sparta United across midfield with it. Number 14 again, she's quick, Sarah Scanchi, but sized up there defensively. Number 15 with a great job, Erica Falarski on defense for Synergy. Number seven in the middle, Stephanie Dudley, shot on goal into the hands of Michelle Von Aken. And another save and she'll have the kick. High into the air. And a whistle against number 14. Jen Vanderpool. And one thing that they, you know, I can see here is that Synergy needs to do a better job of starting to win some of these free kicks, goal kicks. Even on their own, you know, side, get to the ball a little bit quicker. Towards the net on a bounce, going to be wide, and another opportunity for a goal kick. So let's see how they play it here. Synergy, they've got the opportunity on the goal kick. Three substitutions into the match. Number six, Rachel Weber. Number sixteen, Noel. Ekanamu and number 25, I believe. Callie Willett. So three sets of fresh legs in now for Synergy. Number 21 dribbling out of some trouble in the middle of the field there. That's Maddie Adams. Ball far side of the field. Into the middle now. Defensively, Synergy stepping up. But right now they're just reacting. Need to be a little bit more proactive. Cutting those passing lanes off. That's a nice takeaway right there. Up to midfield and across. 
They've got to get Sparta United out of their rhythm. They need some more takeaways. And right there in front of the referee, a whistle and the free kick to Sparta United. And right here, it's getting critical. Synergy. They need to win this. They need a takeaway. We're here in the second half. They trail 1-0. Halfway through the second half, 15 minute mark, there's the kick down the middle of the field. Synergy trying to come away with it. It's pushed here to the near side. Sparta United still with the control on a couple of bounces. That ball right of the hands of the keeper, Michelle Van Aken. Michelle getting busy. And if you're Synergy, you'd like to make Lexi Smith that busy, the keeper for Sparta United. We haven't seen her for quite a few minutes over on the left half of the field as Sparta United has kept the action on the right half, but now Synergy breaks free. Here on the near side, Liz Frazier, number 11, stops, changes direction. Now she goes back here to number 16, Noel Ekanamu. Up top, number three, Britt Pullen. Poland's going to be pushed up towards midfield. Tries to get it back. Rolls over to the far side. Picked up there, number one. Haverly Snyder. Ball still in play. Rolls towards the corner on that far side. Synergy with the cross. Oh, the shot is going to go just wider than that. But hey, if you're Synergy, you got to look at the fact that you've broken down the defense. You got a shot. And now you want to put some pressure so that Sparta United, well, and actually, let's see, it was last touched by Sparta United, giving a corner kick to Synergy from the far side. Liz Frazier, number 11. So an opportunity here for Synergy as they trail 1-0. There's the kick, high into the air, placed nicely in the middle, cleared out by Sparta United. Synergy, though, is they going to allow that ball to get past midfield. Number 26, the stopgap is there, right at midfield. Mia Patrovito. Mia tries to get back to it. And now the give and go right there. Defense is fine as they get back. Number 21 trying to get past him. She's got three defenders on her, and she'll just waste that one out across the back line, so the goal kick to Synergy. And now the pace of the match starting to pick up. You know, here in the second half, we started out a bit quick and then went into about a 12-minute lull where it was just a little bit slow. And the pace now picking up again. And, and to be honest, the pace was kind of picked up by Synergy as they had that last shot on goal. They had the corner kick last time up, or last time into the defensive third of Sparta United. So they had a little spark there. And now again, they're moving the ball right to left. Number 27 gets back to it. Bree Borsellino into the middle. Bree's kick up towards the keeper and picked up there by Lexi Smith. But, you know, it was just a few minutes ago that I was saying, hey, we hadn't seen Lexi Smith in quite some time. And now, two shots on goal, corner kick as well for Synergy. So they're trying to make something happen down here on the left half of the field. Defense has to get back now, firing towards the net. And again, Michelle Vanakin, is there another save? So Michelle keeping this team in this one, only having allowed that first score about 10 minutes in, 12 minutes in to the match. Ball out near side. It will be Sparta United ball. Sparta United, number 23, Gabrielle Mattencaw will put the ball into play. And a quick whistle that's going to go against Sparta United. Synergy quickly now. They don't want to allow Sparta United to get placed. And now finally firing it up towards midfield and across. And out, last touched by 
synergy, and it will be Sparta United ball. Ball near side, now into the middle. Incidental contact right there. Sparty United. Looks like they want to slow things down as they're spreading the field. Now they go upfield, down the middle. Nobody there but Synergies, number 16, Noel Ekanamu. And taken away far side by Sparta United across midfield. Now Sparta United with some pep to their step. And now back to midfield. Number 18 comes firing across. Kerry Hanley disrupts that pass, but Sparta United, reco United recovers. And they retain control of the ball. And let's see, we have a whistle and we're going to have a substitution by Sparta, but I'm not sure what the original whistle was for, unless it was just a late reaction. They're going to drop it there. And so the ball goes over to Sparta United, and again, both squads just kind of standing there. Somebody needs to attack. Let's go. And now Synergy to midfield with it. Nice job coming across on that takeaway, number 27 from behind, Bree Borsellino. Bree battling for it. She's looking for some help. Trying to step up there was number three, Britt Pullen. Pullen with the takeaway. Now she's looking for somewhere to go. Moves it to the far side, number 29. Bridget Whitman upfield with the pass. So a very strange game here in the second half. It's like we get going, then we come to a standstill. Then we get going, we come to a standstill. So if you're Sparta United, you're probably okay with it. Number 14 tries to get past the defense, can't do it. Ball rolls here to the near side, safe from going out. Number 16. For Synergy, Noel Ekanamu, and there's a whistle and the kick there. The illegal going against Sparta United. Quickly, Synergy gets it upfield, using the near sideline here. Number 18 saves it from going out. She's flying up across midfield. Kerry Hanley runs into some trouble, changes direction, does a nice job of getting rid of it into the circle there. Britt Pullen, far side, that's going to roll out. And Sparta United will have it. And Synergy wants substitutions. Referee didn't see it. And again, it goes out. Oh, 23rd minute of this match. Across midfield, Sparta United. So seven minutes to go for Synergy to try and tie this match. But, you know, as I was saying earlier, you've had that 1-0 lead if you're Sparta United since early in the first half. You've had a couple of opportunities to add to it. But at the end of the day, there's six minutes to go, and you're only up by one. Synergy still with an opportunity here to tie this match. Ball wide. Now rolls into the near side. Number four will pick it up. Goes inside. Pass deflected. That was Whitney King. Nice job by the Synergy defense to clear it away from that inner box there in front of the net. And that is going to be off. Sparta United quickly Synergy would like to get their substitutions in. Number 11, 7, and number 31. So Liz Frazier, Christian Warner, and Ashley Oltman back in now. We start the final six minutes or so of this match. Remember, no overtime here, so if Synergy can get the score, this one will end in a tie. So long as that's the only score <laughs> the rest of the way. Of course, 
Number 18 across midfield. Carry Hanley. Now she moves it inside. Nice pass, they get in deep. Oh, number 15 tried to run that one down. Erica Falarski, the ball just placed a little bit too far out in front and the keeper, Lexi Smith, dives on it and makes a stop. Synergy keeping the ball here on the left half. That's what they need to do. Continue with the pressure. Erica Flarsky, number 15, was in on the action again, but now into the backfield of Synergy, fired back across. And the whistle net's gonna go against Sparty United. Nice job, nice opportunity here on the free kick for Synergy's number three, Britt Pullen. Let's see where she goes. And she's gonna attack down the middle. Header behind the defender, knocked out by the keeper. Ball still in play in front of the net. Now it comes out. Oh, Synergy. Not sure if they had an opportunity or not there, but the ball was in deep. But regardless, if you're Sparty United, you're glad the ball is out back towards midfield. And this is where the pace can become frantic. If you're trying to defend a one 0 lead, and the team that's down is starting to attack, and they're going all wild on you in your territory. Funny things can happen. Number five is out for Sparta United, Megan Westman. Number 23 with the first touch, Gabrielle Mattenkaw. Synergy's going to have it. Let's see what they spread it out. Over to the far side, number 29, Bridget Whitman. Number two, trying to save it from going out. Can't do it. Amber McCallan. And so the ball belongs to Synergy far side. It's a throw in. All right, action resumes, but stepping right in front there, number 13, Rebecca Solomon for Sparta United. Synergy looking to get it back. Time is running out on this Synergy squad. They only trail by one, though, so you can go to the final seconds. Sparta towards the back line. It's out. Two minutes to go unofficially here in this match. So if you're Synergy, you want those final two minutes to take place here on the left half of the field. Fired up towards midfield. One, though, by Sparta United. They bring it back the other way. Number nine, dribbling her way in now with the right leg. Fires, and it's going to be wider than that. Goal kick for Synergy. They want a quick substitution before the goal kick. Number 27 back into the match. Bree Borsellino. Number 15 will come out. Erica Falarski. Kick high into the air. Still rolls here to the near side. Saved here on the near side. Number 18. Kerry Hanley. Synergy now. On the attack, they move it into the middle of the field. Can they get a shot? No, it's going to go out across the back line. And the ball will belong to Synergy. They wanted a penalty in deep there, but no go. Corner kick here for Synergy. They still have got an opportunity. Place this kick nicely. Anything can happen. Final minute or so of this match. They trail by one. So they don't attack. They start their offense going now. They want to move into the middle. There's the cross. Picked up there by number four. Shot towards the back line. So number four, Ali Stellatello. Might have just fired that one a split second prematurely. And it's Sparty United firing it across midfield. Ball in the middle of the field. And now there's the whistle on the far side, so that game is over, and you know they're about a minute ahead of us, so just about a minute, maybe less, remaining here in the circle. Free kick, number three.
Grit pulling. Synergy trying to make something happen here. Down to their last moments. They trail by one. And wow, wouldn't that be something to Sparty United? They score with about at about the 10, 11 minute mark, I believe, of the first half. And if they let this let that hold up, that's how we're gonna end. It is still one at nil. Number 23 goes back with it. Gabrielle Mattencon, if you're Sparty United, you know, you don't want to do that. You don't want to give Synergy an opening by sending the ball back the other way. Ball in the middle. Sparty United fires it here to the near side. Now it's going to go deep. And on a bounce into the hands of the keeper, Michelle Von Aken. Fired high into the air. Bounces once over Frazier. Can she get to it and make something happen? She's trying to use her strength to do so. It goes out far side. And will belong to Sparty United. The referee looking at his watch. We're very close here. Great game. Ball far side of the field. And let's see, both players get tangled up. The whistle, it goes to Sparta United. And we're on borrowed time right now. My clock is off. So let's see if they will allow a final chance here. There's the whistle as they bring it back in. And the final here at Kellogg's Zayer Field number four, the 2010 Las Vegas Mayor's Cup. Synergy will fall 1-0 to Sparta United 93. Sparta United with the score. Just about 12 minutes into this match and they make it stand as they don't allow a score for Synergy. King Zaws here for George Langevin Productions. We hope you enjoyed this match. There's plenty of soccer for both of, both of these squads remaining here this weekend. We wish them both luck. And again, the final score. Sparta United 1, Synergy 0. Until we see you next time, have a great day, everybody.